5 Essential Windows CMD Commands for Managing the Firewall Open Command Prompt with Elevated Permissions Type CMD in the search bar and run Command Prompt, Admin 1. Netch Add Firewall Show Current Profile the command netch add firewall show current profile is a useful command in Windows that displays the current firewall profile settings. The benefits of using this command are Visibility, it allows you to see the current settings of your firewall, which can help you understand your network's current level of protection. Troubleshooting, if you're experiencing network issues, this command can help identify if the firewall settings could be the cause. Security Assessment By reviewing the current profile settings, you can assess whether your firewall's configuration aligns with your desired security level. 2. Netch Add Firewall Set Current Profile State on off. Type the following command to enable or disable the firewall. Netch Add Firewall Set Current Profile State on. This command will enable the firewall for the currently active profile. Replace on with off to disable the firewall one. Please note that disabling your firewall can expose your system to potential threats. Here are some benefits of using this command. Control, this command gives you direct control over your firewall's operational state, allowing you to quickly enable or disable it as needed. Troubleshooting, if you're diagnosing network connectivity issues, temporarily disabling the firewall can help determine if it's the source of the problem. Flexibility, this command allows you to adjust your firewall settings to suit different environments. For example, you might want to disable the firewall on a trusted network and enable it when connected to a public network. 3. Add a new inbound or outbound rule to allow or block traffic for a specific program. Type the following command to add a new rule, for example, you have a game installed on your computer and you want to prevent it from accessing the internet. Here's how you can do it. Netch add firewall firewall add rule name equals rule name dir equals in action equals allow program equals path to program. Replace rule name with the name you want to give the rule. Change dir equals into dir equals out for outbound rules, and action equals allow to action equals block to block traffic 1. Path to program with the full path to the program you want to allow or block. Benefits of using this command. Customization. This command allows you to customize your firewall settings for individual programs, giving you fine-grained control over your network security. Security. By blocking or allowing traffic for specific programs, you can enhance your system's security. For example, you might want to block a program that you suspect is malicious. Troubleshooting. If a program is having trouble connecting to the internet, adding a rule to allow its traffic could solve the problem. Control, this command gives you the ability to control which programs on your system can send or receive traffic, helping to prevent unwanted network activity. Delete a firewall rule by its name. Type the following command to delete a rule. Netch add firewall firewall delete rule name equals rule name. Replace rule name with the name of the rule you want to delete. Benefits of using this command. Simplicity. This command provides a straightforward way to remove firewall rules that are no longer needed, helping to keep your firewall configuration clean and manageable. Control. If a rule was added by mistake or is causing issues, this command allows you to quickly remove it. Security. In some cases, removing a rule can enhance your system's security by closing off unnecessary openings in your firewall. Netch add firewall firewall show rule name equals all, displays all existing firewall rules. Benefits of using this command. Overview. This command provides a comprehensive view of all the firewall rules currently in place on your system. This can be useful for getting a quick snapshot of your network security settings. Troubleshooting. If you're experiencing network issues, this command can help identify if a specific firewall rule could be the cause. Security assessment. By reviewing all the firewall rules, you can assess whether your firewall's configuration aligns with your desired security level. Management. This command can be useful for managing your firewall rules. 
For example, you might want to delete or modify a rule, and seeing all the rules together can help you decide which one to change.